think it's going to take a shift in our belief system from the idea that work should be an option for everybody to the belief that work is expected of everybody and not working should be the exception. And a collaboration of all of the different people in the community, the employers, the families, and the people wanting to work, uh, working together to make it happen. I think it'll take assisting people with disabilities to sit down with employers and to get to know each other, to talk and develop relationships. So service providers, VR counselors, community members, parents, we need to be mediators and assist those two populations of people to come together and get to know each other better. And I think that's going to be the beginning. So I think personally that the, the best strategy to engage the state and local communities is to start young and get the individuals from a young age invested in this project. On a statewide level, I think that if you go to the legislators personally and invite them to the table with us and allow them to brainstorm um, and engage their personal ideas in this concept of change, they'll be more vested in it to take it back to the Capitol and then engage their communities and um, their committees there to invest their time. And I think locally, it's just a matter of collaboration. You have to really get the message out there in a positive way. And and show what's in it for them. You can't always talk about what's in it for me because people don't always want to help you. They want to, they want to know what's helping them. Well, I think we need to strengthen our relationship with vocational rehabilitation, especially um, with youth transition programs in the schools. Well, I think it's going to be finding all the voc rehab, all the providers, and to really come together and communicate and come up with a common goal of you know, how we're going to create more jobs for people with disabilities and not just, you know, add more systematic and more paper trails uh, to the system and just really get to a real focus and a goal that we can all work on together. I think what we need is to train everybody, to train people that with a disability, to train the VR and and people that work for the state that they know what the disability is and then then they can go forward and find that job that person needs. I believe that the state of Oregon has focused on the social justice and rights of people with developmental disabilities for a long time and this is just a logical progression for the state to take to continue that journey and that's going to require a great deal of collaboration and work not only between the agencies, organizations and providers that serve people with disabilities but also with the communities and families that are involved in the lives of people with developmental disabilities. Without that collaboration, I don't think that any one of us can make it happen.